Oh, this is more evidence for years I've had all this. They know not to offer any appointment. And this is Graham. He knows exactly that too. And all the other agents working for this company in England. And they're basically the uh, housing maintenance uh, contract from Home Group Limited to MPS Housing Limited, Mears Group PLC. Who mighty PLC has a contract, it's all interlinked with England, all the Freemasons. So, this has been going on for years. When they began setting me up in 20, March 2017, home invasion. Uh, 10th of July 2017, set up with a heart attack and you know, monitoring the technology behind that they use. Brain interface technology, educate yourself to law. And board slash mind control, you can find it all out yourself if you want. And all this paperwork, right? Always having to counterclaim out and rebuttal, so there's such presumptions about my private life. It's all business and commerce. And they only want to come back in urgently without notice, right? Unlawfully. Um, you know, they have to give you a lawful reasonable adjustments when you're physically disabled. And they're not again, so of course, this is AI produced straight after when I get set up with risk to my life again. That was, uh, and then the repair bloke for the wheelchair come out. They, he's been used safe on the, again, on the 16th of the 8th, 2022. They're trying to send him back out again to rush back out because they stitched me up with a new world order agenda for disabled people. Very demonic things I won't go into now, only because it's an iron physical disabled. They want to get rid of people in my situation in a demonic way, especially me. And others like me in target program. So therefore, when you're practically trying to get goods and services, because on top you got physical disabilities, I'm being blocked to my other uh, um, other services, which is uh, <sighs> go away, you perps, you demons. They're just now it's a war mean that they've got a job to do with the satanic ritual abuses they do. Right, on target individuals, they've got to ramp up the targeting, again, gaslighting. This ritual, demonic, it really is. So, I try to be polite, counterclaim offers, but because they're blocking the repairs, they just want me out of the flat. I've been negotiating this, I've got a report, 2019, 2019, to confirm who failed me, my administration. But nobody's held accountable. They're told not to be out of cannibal. When you're in this program all your life, they do not offer any lawful due process at all in any subject. Set up the adult safeguard in 2018. That was Millbrook Healthcare Limited Company. It, this area is uh, agents, OT equipment department side. NHS England Limited holds that contract. Uh, they contract out business services in England. To these company agents and they lied about my flat it wasn't as bad as it was as it they've caused now since 2018 to date and because i learned law talk law contract law common law etc etc they hate it really hate it i tell you and um times we're living in in 2022 right and then of course they wanted me to reduce my terms of secure tender and, and that means me for now and losing everything in the sense of I lose financially. I lose my 13 year built up potential. And uh, I've had all this trauma stuff before me, old house, and what they did then. And they're perpetrated since I moved in, since I got one over as well at the end of that year. So it's all meditated, you know, all premeditated, all this BS that's going on for so long. And uh, on top of all this, there's always constant, the trauma side, to monitor your brain re responses. You're constantly having to respond. So you know, despite doing the emails, despite letters, they were still ignore you. 
and they were still lying and still cheap because you don't deal with any decent individual trauma based mind control and the gaslighting so it's just repetitive they would uh, uh so yeah the wheelchair they're talking to me with the due energy technology in my body at the moment demonically Ugh. Temp for the um, September 2022. They're doing this deliberately because uh, they want to get in for my birthday date. Because last year, what they did is set me up a similar position. I went on my old diaries and dates and what was going on then as well. And I'll confirm it's exactly the same, right? It's always the same, but in different kind of tactics. It's really like a military position, what they're doing. So, of course... Um, Automatically, a dated, predated letter, 3rd of the 9th, 2022, postal strike, well, we delayed it, got here still though, didn't it? And uh, offering, what, three days notice for gas service repair? Well, it's not lawfully due, so here I'll go again, counterclaiming different dates. Unfortunately, I'm unable to assist you this week. It's exactly what is they're trying to do with Blatchford Limited Company on their contract in wheelchair service. Hold on, I was informed that I, there wasn't a job raised. So I'm not dealing with anything until after bloody uh, Monday. Made it that clear. Because of my health, you know. I'm getting, they're, they're palpitating in my heart. And getting, trying to get me really stressed out and all that BS. I'm trying to take it easy. I am not dealing with this BS. Paperwork, I just was looking for the dates of last year and what happened and the old paperwork which I found, which is going back where it went. So um, I've just got a very basic and simple response to saying, well, I did report the tap repairs in 2021 and also I did count came out before. On the housing management records, it still states that you're meant to be offering an afternoon appointment and yet you're after uh, after 1pm. And yet you're still automatically doing the 12 o'clock onwards. I am not calling the gas department, which got me set up with my, my sister in 2022. She lied and she manipulated um, on my behalf because they really did not give a shite in that year either. So, uh, Jan Janice, whatever, I won't say the last information. She was paid to go outside me and buy my sister. Now, this bigger picture here is, um, I don't care they can hear me. They always bug your, your home and everything going on. Uh, so, when you are a child of God and you have morals and standings, they hate it, these symptoms. They really hate it. They attack you in every corner. So where you're physically trying to exist, right? <laughs> they know full well I got set up and got robbed beginning of the year by the police. The Freemason connections. And, uh, and the door got smashed in because of it. Right by them. And they failed to call the outlaw locksmith. And do you think I got the repair for the flat door? My flat door? No. Nine months in, again, yet they can repair the main communal back door unsafely, which makes it difficult for me to use my wheelchair getting in from the car park site. Yeah, so they don't care about the expense on that, and that's done by the Freemasons to make it really difficult for me to enter and access my communal area to my own home. So anyone coming into this, i.e. gas service boiler, we look at the condition of my flat again and report it back. And what they do behind the scenes, they uh, raise uh, assumption presumptions, publications, adult safeguarding again. And they brought in nationally 2019 a Ministry of Justice limited company agents to reopen a matter which is a civil matter, it's nothing to do with anyone else, separate altogether, it's meant to be. And the Crim Injuries Compensation Limited Company, Glasgow Head Office Agents, um, who, of course, fraudulent claims about my health, social care, right? And made assumptions about my ability to make a bloody decision. 
How much paper paperwork and typing I've done? The fact is, the reason why I couldn't take the rest of the payment offer since uh, 2007 to date was my physical reduction of my health. So all of the policies, best practice policies, for victims of crime and vulnerable witnesses has been completely ignored. And key maritime law subject in that regard is all being linked locally. They they brought it all in to local Freemasons to set me up. Oh, we're concerned about our welfare. And you know now it's integrated with all these company agents, public and private, are working in together with Agenda 2030. So... It's more than that in my UK. It's much more deeper than that. So they're singling me out. Especially around it. So the perpetrators, the foot soldiers, or the demonic entities of the satanic uh, entities, shall we call it that, are working for the darker cultists. And, uh, and a certain individuals I can't mention specifics because I could be careful you have to be careful what you do and say anything nowadays but they know what you're going to say before they do it <laughs> so um it's not just a simple issue of a gas safety border check it they they fitted everything in together it's made a right old happy davies I have done seven page happy davy the last one they didn't mind that and it doesn't matter how much evidence you've got, how much reports you've got, and how much you've done. They have one agenda to make you homeless, to lose your jobs, keep your wife and your friends, your family. And they've done a bloody good job of that. And this is why they're making me homeless on top now. And they will get it all covered up. So I hope you demons, well, you're already in hell. <laughs> your soul's already been sold out. I'll survive. Somehow, when I get some energy and fresh up, I will do a printout because I want you to use your ink up and then pay out more and this and the other. That's what they do with me. So, this is my evidence of email and uh, about the, the taps. It's not just the taps now, it's, it's other stuff that's going wrong. And I tell you, I have looked where I could move without financially being affected negatively, right? With uh, um, health care housing, but there isn't anything in this terms of going in. Because the world is upside bloody down in England. Well, you talk about the dark winter, I ain't bloody no joke, I tell you. I can watch my date now, but I go. Um, but anyway, this is really a serious shite. Yeah, again. <laughs>